Eleusis is kind of like the spiritual capital of the ancient Mediterranean and pilgrims every single year for about 2000 years would walk from Athens to Eleusis uh, to consume a magical potion, uh, the ingredients of which had been lost to time, uh, but the effects of which had been retained, which is that they became immortal. So you confronted death face to face, and only because of that confrontation were you guaranteed the afterlife. Burning Man is the closest thing that I think we have today to a modern elusis. People come for a process of collective transformation and they emerge changed and then they bring that back out into the world. This is arguably one of the most influential discoveries of our time. And we have this unique opportunity to bridge history, culture and human transformation through art. The challenge here is how do we bring such a complex story to life while impacting as many people as possible? We're constantly exploring new ways of storytelling through art. This year, we're creating a sculpture that weighs over 20,000 pounds, a sky story with a thousand drones, a choreographed soundtrack, and a lecture series with the author, all combined into an immersive experience telling the story of Eleusis. We believe when a drone show is done right, that it can create this state of awe and wonder. And something that's super unique about this art form, it is the largest animated art form, and it's one of the only, if not the only piece of art that you can see from pretty much anywhere on fine. Anyone that looks up in the sky can see it and have a collective experience. I've been touring and releasing albums with the Glitch Mob for 15 years now, and I have ambient projects and for me working in new dimensions is specifically why i do this this is why i make electronic music the idea of being on the edge of art and technology is really what gets me going and what what cooler place is there to do that than outside under the stars looking up in the sky this is an incredibly complex production, especially with the harsh and unpredictable conditions that we'll face out there. Um, from the time Hunter called us, we've had about five weeks until loadout. Um, that gives us enough time to do structural, uh, interior detailing, all of the fabrication here at the shop, um, the assembly, exterior finishing all the above. So it's been a pretty tight timeline. For the last eight days, we've been working on these modular pieces for this chalice. And basically every step of the way from assembling the CNC parts to, to laying down burlap, to cutting things out, building keyholes, problem solving like crazy. My work either recreates or emphasizes the psychedelic experience, which I think really goes hand in hand with the, the whole Eleusinian mystery. The crazy part with this drone show is we won't have time to test fly this. The first time we'll see this fly will be a Burning Man in front of 70,000 people.